Hello, it's late at night and uh, well, I've just checked to see if there's a new BIOS for my uh, X570 motherboard. It's the Asus uh, Prime X570 Pro and there does seem to be a new BIOS. So let me show you. Right, so I don't know if you can see that. We've got version 1201 and I'm hoping now that I've installed this that we're going to get the advertised boost clocks of my 3600, my Ryzen 5 3600. So let's uh, get into Windows and uh, check to see, uh, well, if the fix has fixed the problem. So let's do it. Okay, so we're in Windows now and I've just messed around with Chrome, did a stress test and so forth. I hope that you can see that, but we've managed to hit 4.2 or 4.192 megahertz on three of the six cores there. So that's basically 4.2 on three of the cores. So yeah, we are literally hitting maximum boost as described by AMD for their Ryzen 5 3600 processor. So I'm just going to do a quick test with uh, PBO enabled so uh, we'll come back in a moment. Okay so we've enabled precision boost overdrive and auto OC uh, with uh, 100 megahertz OC and um, we are now getting on core 5 and 6 we are getting 4217 megahertz. So yeah, we're getting over the 4.2 gigahertz that AMD says that a single core can max boost to at any given time. So it looks like it's fixed. So the new GISA or GISA, however you want to pronounce it, update that AMD have supplied to the vendors, in my case Asus or Zeus, um, has solved the problem. So uh, yeah, I thought I'd just put that out there and make this really quick and raw video and uh, yeah, keep checking the biases and uh, have fun. All right, cheers, thanks for watching.